I'm gonna do a little weird intro. Uh, welcome back to the channel. <laughs> um, at uh, what's this place? Point Claire. This morning, um, yesterday morning was here, and Mike found the uh, um, Modern Classics chase. And so they got all this stuff. They got the Porsche, they had the Fast and Furious, Modern Classics, all Boulevard, everything. Two packs, Mystery Models 1. I don't think they were here yesterday. But anyway, so I didn't come here this morning because I was thinking there's not going to be anything coming in. And I was actually thinking maybe I should check just in case because a lot of the times M2s come in <laughs> when Hot Wheels don't. And look at this. Two Blazers, where's the rest of the Coke set? There's only the two of them there. And they got the one thing that I was really looking forward to finding because there are multiple chases in this set. And it is an amazing set, a square body set. So we got the Sierra Grand 15, beautiful baby blue. Kind of takes away from the, the lines there, but it's nice. Got Blazer, Van, these C10s, just awesome. This one has a super chase, wouldn't that be sweet? And then you got the Dually, also has a chase. And this guy, sorry, the Dually doesn't. This guy has a chase. Just great looking set. I've been waiting for this, but it, it like, I'm doing the counts here, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Should be six, nine, ten. And if, I can't remember if these two are in that set. I think the K5 is, but I can't remember... I guess it has to be a square body syndicate. They're both square body syndicates. So there's one of this missing and one of this missing. And these don't have chases. So I don't think I missed out on anything uh, chase wise, but great to see this set here. Like I said, been waiting for it to show up and here she is. So a little different intro. Coming here, not expecting anything, just uh, trying to get some information and there you go. So, moving on. Hopefully we can find this at another store. Maybe check Valley Field, see if they got it too. Tuesday night. Kirkland. Should be a lot of stuff tonight. And there is. Got Boulevard right there. Got Monster Trucks. What else we got here? Something right there, 10 piece. Maybe it's not that much. Maybe it's just Boulevard and car culture. Is that car culture? Not car culture, I think it's uh, neon speeders with that label see if anything has gone out been stocked yet doesn't look like it no nothing stocked yet so see if i can find somebody and see what else is on there Boulevard, not that interested in, obviously. But if there is car culture, obviously interested in that. Hot Wheels cars, what are you? 10 piece. Oh yeah, there's a bunch of stuff in, in there, 10 piece. Not sure what that guy is. Pop culture, different box. But there's car culture right down there. GBG25, is that? Not sure what that is either. So, bunch of stuff in here. Wait and see if someone comes to stock it and see if we can get some stuff open. I'm here uh, waiting. 
and I didn't even notice that they had already put vintage out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten and no Camaro. So, maybe, maybe we'll get it one day. I can't believe I didn't notice it. Well, I guess it's right at the bottom there. So, anyway, continue waiting until they come to do the stocking and then see what else is on the pallet. There's a match box. Yeah. So the nice ladies uh, opened them up. Um, this is a Matchbox. It's the ones that were in the shipper, the Volkswagen, Matchbox Volkswagen set. Um, not interested in that. I'm not sure what this is though, because it's a different code. And I thought it was the same case. And then they got the two cases of uh, boulevards. I asked if I could stock them. She said, don't worry, I'll open them and they can stock them at night. So we all know what the boulevards are. I was hoping that there was, uh, um, whatchamacallit, Fast and Furious premiums again. But there doesn't appear to be. I don't know what this is either. Mario Kart. Okay, cool. And Pop Culture 956B is the one that we've seen with the Batmobile and the... Uh, uh, Batmobile, the Nissan Concept, and whatever. The one that they advertise with the GTR that doesn't come with the GTR. And then we got Car Culture. Car Culture. Oh, well. <laughs> well. How many of these did they make? Um... I might have to do a giveaway. What do you guys think? 5,000 subscriber giveaway? I think giveaway an Alteza for 5,000 subs. <laughs> uh, I think that's a good idea. I think that's a good idea. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna. Oh fuck, I don't know. <laughs> what a palette. Look at all that, Mattel. Uh, okay. That's it. <laughs> I'm moving on. Just back at Kirkland. Just to see if there was uh, something else on that pallet that I missed. So. They only put out one case of boulevards. That's weird. Okay. Okay. Interesting, these are the Matchbox, that set. I saw this in Shippers earlier in the, well, last year, I guess. So it's surprising that it's coming out again, but then again, we got that uh, France set too. So I guess just the boulevards, the car culture. Hey, there's one Alteza missing, weird. <laughs> um, vintage, the pop culture. And Mario Kart, we saw that. And the other case of this was the minis. There were two cases of the new mini set. Um, yeah. So that's all that was stocked. I guess we didn't miss um, anything in the middle of the pallet or anything. Cool. Uh, I don't know if they'll get the square bodies here with all these, with all this stuff. That's all the same. Okay, cool. Well, we'll move along. Next, Walmart. Can't imagine that they got anything new. Well, maybe they did. I don't remember the Volkswagen set being here and it's full. <laughs> How could they get more? Full two packs too. 
Nissan, Subarus, Bugattis, more. Wow. That's crazy. Square bodies. Let's see. Let's see what's still here. One. They're mostly still here. Let's take another look. I think I should buy. I think I should get a couple. They're very nice. I really want to know about these. Like if a uh, case went out, there is uh, possibly a chase of the other two cars in the set. And so person got the chase and the main line or let me know. I mean, I'd probably do it. Well, that's a different legend set. Not that it's something that I'm really interested in, but Gas Monkey Garage. You got the Firebird from last year. Bone Shaker. Interesting. Is it interesting? I don't know. And then this Legends Tour set. This will be here for a long, long time. So I guess that's it. I guess they put out Volkswagens last night and two packs. It's crazy. Craziness, it tells you. Is it new? More Matchbox? What we get at some point? A chase case ever again? I don't know. Okay, cool. So we'll uh, pick it up after school and uh, do Dollaramas again. Maybe there will be something worth filming. <laughs> they haven't got anything in so long. Okay, see you later. Just picking it up next day. My Claire, or Kirklet. They got neon speeders. Wasn't expecting anything to be put out, but I guess they were, uh, maybe they were on that pallet the other day. They put out the minis. Looks like they put out another boulevard. Yeah, they put out the second boulevard. And something else. Vintage was here. One forty threes are here. Those were here. And Bronco is sweet. How much was this? Jesus. <laughs> 429,000 for a 1970 Bronco. That's insane. I'm sure it was beautiful, but that's crazy money. And M2s are the same. So I guess just the uh, Neon Speeders, Matchbox, and Boulevard went out. So, go check out Point Clear. Point Clear. And I don't think anything has come in. Wow, the two packs are still going. Going crazy. They're full yesterday and now two Bugattis. Everything else gone. It's good, it's good. It's good. Yeah, I think that's it. Nothing new. M2s are a mess. Everything's a mess. As usual. Okay, well, we'll pick it up later. So, does anybody want this Alteza? I think I've been lucky enough with this. It's time to give one away. And we're almost at 5,000 subscribers, so this is going to be... 5,000 subscriber giveaway. 
And I want to say, from the bottom of my heart, I really appreciate everyone who has been watching, who's been subscribing, liking, interacting. I've been having a lot of fun with it. Uh, started this a year and a half ago. Just figured, give it a shot, have some fun. Wanted to share what I was finding. And it's just been amazing. I've been having so much fun uh, doing this, interacting with you guys, meeting new people uh, in person and online. It's just been great. So I really appreciate it. So let's do a giveaway. Simple rules. I'm going to pick a number between 1 and 5,000. And you're going to email me that number. So 514.diecast at gmail.com. The subject of the email, put Alteza giveaway, just Alteza giveaway. The content of the email, simply put your YouTube name and the number you're guessing. Again, between one and 5,000. The closest without going over, price is right rules, uh, will win the chase. Um, yeah, that's it. You have to be subscribed, pick a number between one and 5,000, closest without going over wins. We will run the contest until April 14th. That will be the last day that you can send in an email. Give it a couple weeks. And uh, yeah, that's it. If there's a tie somehow, we'll do a tiebreaker of something. I'll contact uh, both or multiple people and we'll just do a re-guess of some sort. And just in case there's some somebody wants to do some uh, scamming or whatever. Um, I will not contact anyone with a request for any money at any point. There will be no shipping cost. There will be no cost to you whatsoever. When um, the contest is over, I will announce the winner on a video after the 14th. And after the video goes out, I will email that person. Um, so if anybody reaches out to you from something that's similar to my email or claiming that they're me, it's not me, don't give anyone any money, don't uh, respond to anything that's uh, similar. So that's it, I think. I think that's it. Once again, honestly, I appreciate you guys watching. Like I said, it's just been a blast and it continues to be a blast and hope to be doing this for a little while longer for sure. So get your entries in, email me, guess between one and 5,000 and you could win the Alteza Chase. So thanks again and we'll see you at the next hunt. Bye.